All right, I'm gonna show you guys how to uh, properly prep a uh, nap location. Um, so we're gonna go from on the inside going to the tray. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna strip the fiber back to this location. Two zip ties go right here. We also need to change out this insert right here uh, to the insert that's provided in the NID. We're gonna come up here and the strength membranes need to go through this screw and we're gonna attach the strength membranes there. So they requested that we put six foot of buffer tube in here. Six foot of buffer tube is gonna be four wraps. So we're gonna go around one, two, three, and then fourth, on our fourth one, we're going to exit at this point right, located right here, okay? It comes in through the tray right there. Originally, there's two tabs here. Break the inner tab off, and the buffer tube is gonna come around here, and then right at this location, somewhere on this flat spot of it, I want you guys to cut your buffer tube, okay? So, from there, you're going to take your fiber, and the fiber will be dressed in on the outside of the tray. Take all four, dress all four in. Okay, you can get her under that tube so she sits up against the wall. Okay. We're gonna make two loops. So that's one. Staying to the outside of the tray with all four fibers. Again, you can lift that tube up, get those fibers under there. Slide them in there. And this is where your splice point's gonna be. It's right here. And so your fibers need to be cut when you pre-dress this thing right to the middle of there, okay? So what I like to do is just lay those fibers in there and I cut them to what length I want where I'm gonna make my splice at, all right? So the uh, pigtail, I want it to be plugged on the outside port in the top. And what we're gonna do with that is that's gonna come just around here, just lay it on top. It doesn't need to go into it, but it's gonna come in through the bottom of this section right here. And again, there was two tabs here. I broke the inner tab off so that I can squeeze it in there. So then now we're gonna take our it and we're gonna dress it in. Okay, and that is going to come right here, and you're gonna trim that off right where you were gonna make your splice. Then you would pull all this out, burn your, your fiber, and then dress it in the same way that you pre-dressed it in for measurement. And that's how it should look every time. That allows the door to open and close easily with not kinking any tubes or anything like that. So again, here, the buffer tube comes around. Somewhere on this flat spot, I want it to be cut and then stripped down to fiber. Wrap your fiber twice in this direction, ending up right here. You'll bring your pigtail in through the top, coming over the top right here. We're coming through the bottom of the tray and you're gonna wrap it around twice and the second time you're gonna end right here. And this is how it should look every time, nothing should ever change. Thanks guys.